undan nizer o het stanyo. Awira awa unte yar don jadagu. Tone wahra nagara de. Desajera ne rot niha. Nekti yate huayat ane kera. Azekan te tajajera oni. Nekti ya o tena de gari wastakwe. Agungwe da sun a wahuan nordun kwe zi niot ne sagode ya ogunga. Zewajera sri at dizax ne hatham. Raganerun kwakwe unte zi nito gwenyo. Nek zi ohondo yo ha wihtun ya de ha ganerakwe. Zi nuer o jokwa templar a guego tadinya rodar hoks. Ne on ha at ketsanis. Zi got ket sun a riyan a ahigun sagandanu a got gato zi ne sagar raskanex. One day star. Hmm. Oni Ya otena guanek. Guanek. The dun hagedu. The wakiri chironyana. The najogedu na the ratiu da nu yago dunis. How it was? Nexi dosa izi na kahanda di yahaze. Dog <laughs> Of course. Is it as a dot? Aska Degani on Sangayeri. Aska Dewat Nyawe. I literally just went from one, two, three, four, and one hundred, and I gave them only five seconds to move. This is going to be annoying. The second ticker. You son of a bitch. You thought you were hiding <laughs> in plain sight. This is how you're the negiga.
वगू या दैट सॉरी आ ओ नी अजी इज दैट दैट अंडर डॉक पे आई देव इज अ कने ऑक्टा सु अनना आदे व्हाट कैन यू सी यू सी हाँ आधे वक्त रियान दस रिया जिन्हों है ओया अस कदा सहताना कदो गाड़िया Aye, the way Zaka ne okta su anana ada wat kiri tsiru nasi. Turn to the tree, which is seventy-five meters away. Somebody was literally hiding in front of a rock. Like, what the hell? Da hai yani de jinia de as kadasa te. दुवत कड़ी चढ़ू नी What have we here? Familiar. Where have I seen you before? That wasn't very nice. Let me go! <laughs> Listen to that. He knows English. It's not for a savage. You're spirited too. We have questions for your elders. Only tell us where your village is, boy, and you can go. Best do as he asks, child. I could snap your neck, you know. A little more pressure, and pop. The sad little flame of your life extinguished. You are a nothing, a speck of dust. You're a bitch you to and dead. all your ilk, living in the dirt like animals, oblivious to the true ways of the world. The wiser among you recognize the shape of the future. They throw themselves at our feet and beg mercy. But not you, it seems. No. You cling desperately to your ways, too ignorant to know your folly. But I am not unkind. And so I spare you, that you may carry word to your people. Let them know the sooner we are given what we seek, the sooner you can return to your pathetic, empty lives. A fair trade, is it not? What is your name? <laughs> Charles Lee. Why do you ask? So I can find you. <laughs> I look forward to it. You 
rifle but a child? Oh my god. Now I'm suffering a concussion, which will be about six weeks of recovery. More like six months since there's no professional physician to help me. What is that, fire in the background? Find another way. I can find a way. Onakti <laughs> ザハガヨヤネレ
I know trees are strong, but these branches. You draw it on it. I don't know. That I'm not gonna tell your head in there. What, Zook? Garniore non dasse. Zodzi on dore. Oh, Nio, the Easter is a hand set such to get dog a yacha sadatrege. Next, the only hour and it dog at Jada and the Nogihi. Dogo oya, what the Nakunyanio acta, that got zera. I thought he was going to say, if you die, you die. Whatever.
times where it's laggy, and then there are times where right now it's not. Nahoda, what got ni go runi? Yet the wakwenyo aguego young in harange. Go on got their hard days in your aguego on seroroge. Got the gun easter at the gayeri in igu young in yo. Taunt for harage, the gorungadan on the top. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. Yeah, say good day to the house. I'm going to go 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 to the house. Yot kweni ay siya kang hey yate. Kaya ta noro ne giga de haum ta nega. Onik tiyan de wadari huwa kweni as tage ne sa oyera. Tadenaktotas ang dasa de sanuni. Togan sa sadwate ang de wadung nege negario. Tano yam jojera to onet yam sa tari di nume guja daroorox ne gundirio. Di osumagaro de di de watskan hukwa di kahnegi rata. Zezak ne kayan dere um watrori di umwak to dun dun dawari. Hats me, Mwasti de Hom Tanega gone on E. West Square. Oh, hold RB. Oh, I gotta hold. How key oil did that card harder? Kan to zat kar haro. Kan kan niyot. Yo yane re, how jade niyanda ne zaha gariyo dawana ye deniena, jini gariwa isu genir haro. Try 
track of ドエドエス、ザテスタニオスネザオナ。いや、ガヤグレダノガホレオナヤアンガタクサデネガネフ。ネギガスカヤダゲスノサゲアンカツテジアンジェナ。オナクティスケナスンアアンゲ。トガオ
Uh, we'll do that one more time. A deer ate some berries in this bush. Somebody's coming. Oh. <laughs> All right, I got two assassinations down. I need to get a snare and bait. My previous one worked. A deer rested here. I'm not looking for deer. rabbit or a fox. I don't care about the deer. Am I playing Cabela's hunting game? I think I am. Another deer. Deer marked ground here.
pear, ate some flowers here. That's not a rabbit. That's a fox. Is that a rabbit? No, that's a fox. something I caught a fox I was a cock in that one damn it all right let's go back Can I do go? Oh, no, I want this. What's <laughs> good?
Aguahua gets on, he gay. Was get Yago, the Yawa. I'm the Jatan, the owner. I always see her Naja girl who didn't go Rayanda, ne? The Nojera ya ezo de etienna. Next yato deot. Oh, neot. Let Dokawa hagari hunya. Okay, it's on, I think. I got there, yon, there, these are the Hoye wash on a jerna dia, car hog on Chedaweta. On a jerna dia, they a tear jot there near the ne oya ganyoke hog at the water deal. Oh, was soon dade, don't that there, the what Serak was. Yo hunja no runge, yung kwa de na daya, danu ne um ha a jung kwa de wayani ne ayetia se tani sege un jung hunza. Ara haja zi doga ne gandu, ayetiri hune yung kiswas, saha o di sasta serayanda ne. Yung kwa dora zene to na ya de wayer hage. Yung kwa ya do dar he un zino gayera ne de ti swat neda. Danu ne dogat to no de wire, yot de no ayungwa jon ha se. Onu jere di toni ori hawana ne ay de wada den hodu. Greetings, Guardian. Are you a spirit? <coughs> you may think of me as such. Where am I? You are where you were before. If you mean to ask what it is you now see, it is known as the Nexus. From here, probabilities are calculated so that the proper path may be chosen. What path? Yours. <coughs> what the hell? Follow me. Avoid mid-air collisions. It's like some psychedelic drugs that they had back in the 1700s. What have you done to me? Selected a form familiar to your culture. It is designed to ease navigation. We have waited millennia for your arrival. You, who will bring to him the last piece, that he may open the door. I do not understand. Nor need you. I sense my words cause pain. But such was not my intention. You are important, child. In more ways than you will ever know. I think the eagle represents almost As you every see, culture. Forces gather in secret, preparing to seize control of the land. If they succeed, the sanctuary will be breached. Oh no, oh. Oh my god. It baited me into hitting that, man. 
Yours is a special lineage. Past. Present. Future. Many are connected to you. Many who have changed the world. Who will change the world. So too shall you. Oh. I have called you here that you might know your duty. You must protect the sanctuary from those who would undo our work. What sanctuary? What work? Maintaining your current force will result in a negative outcome. Premature access will destabilize the region. Your village and its people will be destroyed. What? What am I to do? You will learn of a man who will provide additional training. Seek this symbol. No doubt you have many questions. Time will see them answered. For now, you must follow. Leading is for later. Oh, I hit into every single object there. Yep, Grandma definitely gave me some psychedelic drugs. Some shrooms. Radun Hagerdun, got nowhere. Got no one is at Gah to Tigo Gari Wire on its doom. A dun heads wagging at Duni. What guard of the room with Daya Jadatka, a hugging at Dunhasse or Neo de Akande. Hm. Don't tune a tiger on nowhere. Easy not Gahanda de Tunis. Gari was Siva Gadari under it. The no easy gi oni. A Rahaja deza deni go rizum, ne dosa seri Wayena. You go our harats done, I had the Wadun Hunjanuna. Next year, the sherry de neat knees. They ought to new hudge or hunjage than o ya, town do a young guada se to hugge. Yaka attack its god again than o agader harder than I the wat wan that ne. Wat gunya do dari sigi, o wadu erra o sette. O nujera di desaderi wadeniani. I say gunya tak gweni da guri wadeni. Yaha sa giga. As a tardy dinner hood as a sack seat garda quinegos. Tonu da got got on a gari wire the nit stone. Ne egi garun where a hawi o yashniena zinio zizatni staha was a gosniena. Yama. Am I going to go meet my father? Seria Sadoga, Nexi gets honey, so the Ezos are hard. Was says Akane Gari Waironitsu, Satahatsori. Leaving home was harder than I thought. I expected the journey would fill me with a sort of pride, a sense of accomplishment. But whatever it was that carried me away from home soon fled, replaced by questions, and no small amount of doubt. Had I been too hasty? Had I made a mistake? 
The others in the village, they thought this was something I wanted, something I chose to do. But it never felt that way to me. No, it was not a choice. It was an obligation. Because if not me, then who? If not me, then who? <sighs> that is a quote to live by. And something is up here, or down there. I think down there. Yeah, I see something. I don't know what that cup means. I could fast travel, but let's just uh, do a little exploration. Ooh. Kill a wolf, I reskinned. Objectives? No. I'm not ready to kill people yet. Get out of the way. After him! What are you doing?
Hello. Hello. You must be one of them native fellas, eh, from the, eh, uh, what's it called? Iroquois tribe. Aye. You from that? Of course not, Terry. Iroquois ain't a tribe. Is so. Is not. The Iroquois is a confederation. Confeder what now? <laughs> Confederation, ya Tony! It's a group, an alliance. Lots of different kinds of people, all united. Right. Like I said, a tribe. Listen, ya Tony-headed twiddle-poop. There's a difference between a tribe and a confederation, and it's not my fault your skull's too thick to make sense of it. Who are you calling a twiddle-poop, you crump buck scab? Hey, now, this is between me and him. Yeah, mind your business. Do you guys need help? <clears throat> I'm kind of liking the Scottish guys. Nothing wrong with the Scots. <laughs> what? Um, I, I was told you could train me. No. <laughs> Rejected. Go away! I'm not leaving! I need a place to camp. There must be another way in. Please, all I ask is a moment of your time. I apologize if I've been unclear or otherwise confused you with my words. It was never my intention to mislead. 
So let me try to clarify. Get the hell off my land. Coming up! This is home invasion. I don't... Hear me out. What are you so afraid of? Afraid? You think I'm afraid of anything? Least of all a self-important little scab like you? Ah. Oh, you might dream of being a hero. Of riding to rescues. Of saving the world. But stay this course. The only thing you're gonna be is dead. Moved on, boy. Best you do too. I will not leave. Do you hear me? I'm never leaving. Just wait, old man. will not be defeated so easily. <coughs> Let me take shelter next to the horses. You will train me. You have to. <gasps> These are square toes. This will be easy. That's what you said last time, and I wound up with a dead horse and a dark eye. Who are you? No one you need concern yourself with, little bridges. Best cut for something bad happens. No. Can't say we didn't warn you. and spirits can't save you. Why are you here? What do you want? Best to ask the boss man. Ah! Oh. He hit me with a shillelagh. You working for the old man then? That it? Maybe this will get you talking. Oh. Oh. <sighs> Thank you. Clean this up. Get that shillelagh? Then I suppose we should talk. I'll keep that. Sorry. Not your fault. This whole place is ready to come down. Goddamn miracle it hasn't already. Anyway, 
Who are you? My name is Rado Hangado. Right. Well, I'm not even going to try and pronounce that. Now, tell me why you're here. I was told to seek this symbol. Do you even know what that symbol represents? Or what it is you're asking for? No. And yet, here you are. The spirit said that... that These I am... spirits of yours have been harassing the assassins for centuries. Ever since Ezio uncorked the bottle. Ah, but you don't even know what an assassin is, do you? Well, best settled in then. I've got a story to tell, and it's gonna take a while to get it all out. And so, this is why the Assassins have dedicated themselves to the pursuit of the Templars. Because if they succeed, your spirit's visions will become reality. Then I will stop them. Oh, I have no doubt you'll try. <sighs> Come on, I've something to show you. Careful. Uh, wasn't a joke when I said this place was coming apart. Why don't you repair it? What's the point? <coughs> Besides, I don't have materials for the job. So buy them. <laughs> you don't have money. <laughs> Look at me! You think I can just march into some store purse full of pounds and go shopping? Yes. Why not? I'm so naive. This way. Man, he had a secret chamber. Don't think you can just come in here, throw those on, and call yourself an assassin. I, I did not. I, I would never presume... That's all right. I know they've a certain allure. Very well. I'll train you. Then we'll know if you've the right to wear those robes. Thank you. Um... Name's Achilles. Come on, then. We've work to do. You are a speck of dust, a nothing. You and all your kind, living in the dirt like animals, oblivious to the true ways of the world. What do the Templars want? What they've always wanted, control. They see an opportunity in the colonies, a chance for new beginnings, unfettered by the chaos of the past. This is why they back the British. Here they have a chance to illustrate the merits of their beliefs, a people in service to the principles of order and structure. I have seen what is to come if they succeed. They have to die, don't they? All of them. Even my father. Especially your father. He's the one holding the whole thing together.
so I trained in running, in climbing, in fighting, in falling. And for every lesson that concerned the body, there were two that concerned the mind. Language, philosophy, logic, the arts. Achilles taught most often of the assassins and Templars, their structures, origins, and purpose. Centuries of history condensed into a few short days. I told him of the men who had burned my village, of Charles Lee and my promise to him. Achilles explained that Lee and his followers were Templars, and that they were led by none other than my own father. If I was to serve the order, these men would become my targets. <coughs> so I worked harder, learned faster, but for all my progress, it was clear that I still had much to learn. My training had only just begun. Ooh, my rifle's still here. Good morning. To you as well. You taking a trip? I've decided to do something about the house. And you're going to help me. Get it. Are we going to learn about architecture too now? Hello. Don't stare. Sorry. Come on. This place is incredible. The people, the sounds and smells. I could walk these streets for days and know not even half its wonders. I thought the same as you upon a time. These days, I much prefer the quiet of the countryside. <gasps> but there is so much life here. So many opportunities. For a few, my boy. For a few. There's a store close to here. You're to buy the items on this list. Tell them where the carriage is, and they'll see that it's loaded. Understood? Yes. Good. You're also going to need a new name. Your skin is fair enough that you might pass for one with uh, Spanish or Italian blood. Better to be thought a Spaniard than a native. And both are better still than I. That is not true. What's true? And what is, aren't always the same. What would you call me, then? Connor. Yes, that will be your name. All right, then. Off you go. Since I'm right here. Oh, thank God I don't have to click in the left thumbstick. Give me Assassin's Creed 2 controls. Is 
Since I'm right here as well, might as well get this one too. Assassin's Creed 2 controls. I need the items on this list. Will you be paying with coin or trade? He likes the money. Some of these things I have, some I don't. Lumber's hard to come by since my supplier up and vanished. I have the tools and pitch, though. Nails, too. So, uh, where do you want this delivered? Our wagon is near the state house. You don't seem too, too shady. My hair would like. All right, let's see. I have some items to sell. A deer tail gives me nothing. This is all like 20 years old, or 10 years old. I don't know if you... What is this? Oh, sell all of it. sell them all. Um, okay. Citizen met mission items? Okay, I guess this is... Okay. I can't unlock any of these. Weapons and blunt weapons. Uh, outfits. Baltimore outfit. Jamestown. Philadelphia. Uh, achieve full sync. On all mission. Oh God. I have to get that prisoner outfit. Alexios.
these maps are expensive. I should return to Achilles. Who stands in Parliament for Boston? For New York? For Virginia? Uh, where is Achilles? What is this? The livery request? What is this? Vigilante? Uh, I can't zoom. Oh, I can zoom in. Vigilante. That's a treasure. No one, but old Sarum is represented, and Newport, and Newtown, Seaford, and Saltan. What's going on here? We're headed to the customs house to toss some quips at the lobsters. What happened? That's what we're going to find out. We're going to follow me. Red back feathers. With me to King Street. We'll show them. Down to the customs house for a spree! Come along! setting then I want motion blur off okay general in this manner is forbidden. We're not going anywhere, bug. Oi! Why don't you go back to England? No good can come of this chaos. Return to your homes and all will be forgiven. Never. Not until you've answered for your crimes. You're right, coward. You don't scare us. guns and unarmed. We ain't afraid. There. Oh. Is that my father? Yes, which means trouble is sure to follow. I need you to tail his accomplice. This crowd is a powder keg. We can't allow him to light the fuse. But... But nothing. Do as I say and go. Come on, you gosh gutted coward. It doesn't shoot at me. Hey, lobster! Go ahead! Fire your little gun! You red back rum so bacon face out! I do soon fight you! Swing at me, why don't you? Oi, you there! What's all the fuss about? Fire at the townhouse.
Your plot has ended. Not quite. Is this supposed to be the Boston Massacre? I forget how, when it is. Oh, escape the zone. I'm not in a good situation. I need to find Achilles. It was the Boston Massacre. Oh, guys are still running after me. Why are they after me? Oh, I do have two notoriety points. Ah, oh, god damn it. You're Achilles, boy. Connor, was it? I saw what happened at the townhouse. A fine mess, that. Who are you? Samuel Adams, at your service. Achilles asked me to get you out of Boston. Explain. The whole city's looking for you. Oh, yay! Oh, yay! A criminal stalks the streets, wanted in connection with the massacre at the townhouse. That's fake Citizens news. Are advised to call the guards if they see him. Ten pounds to whoever brings this mad What am I supposed to, to do? Now you can take down these posters for a start. Return to me once you remove the others. We can't be seen together until these posters are gone. Giving me Assassin's 2 control, this is not good. Oh, so I can't hide in those rooms. It automatically... It'll automatically kick me out. Hmm.
So I gotta get rid of all these fake news posters. And... Ah, Connor. There you are. I'd like you to meet Cyrus. Is it... is he the killer? Peace. Cyrus is on our side, or rather, for the right price he will be. Have you seen this man? Watch and learn. has reached us that the man responsible for today's shooting may have been in disguise. A wig and makeup tin were found near the scene of the crime. Witnesses describe a middle-aged gentleman of pale complexion fleeing towards the wharves, rifle in arm. Thank you kindly, Cyrus. Pleasure. He's making fake news. Come on, man. There's still one last bit of work to do. Where are we going? To the printer. Where do you think all those posters came from? They're made by a machine. We need to shut it down. Oh. Damn it, we're too late. They've set up a checkpoint. Come on. This way. I can go by rooftop and meet you there. No. Better you learn about the tunnels now. Tunnels? The Masons have a whole network of them under the city. They're quite useful when speed and secrecy are required. Sam Adams. I'm following Sam Adams, or he's following me. We can go make some beer. Nope, nope. are you doing? Don't give me Assassin's Creed 2 controls. Uh, looks like the only way is through here. Come on, Sam. Here we are, then. I'll see you inside. Boston's most wanted.
Hold on. Use your lantern to light the lamps, Connor. They'll help us find our way should we get turned around. I wonder why they built these tunnels. I can't help but feel this is the wrong direction. Whoops. Maybe it was this way. Excellent. Let us move on. Sam, you can't slide under there. Mm, much as it pains me to say it, we must follow the rats, as they often move in the direction of an exit. Apologize for ever doubting. No wonder Achilles has taken such an interest in you. Ars. I don't suppose lockpicking is part of your repertoire. Oh man. What was it? Rotate. Okay. done. The printer isn't far. Let us reconvene there. Since I am here, might as well get this. You ask a great deal of me, Sam. I know, but I wouldn't be here if it wasn't important, if it wasn't vital. Fine. 
Just this once, though. In the future, such things will come at a price. Resetting the type is neither quick nor easy. To say nothing of the cost should I be discovered. I shall not forget this kindness. Nor I. <laughs> His work will see your last little bit of notoriety erased. Come, I'll show you how to leave now that order's been restored. So, now you've had a chance to see how it all works. Untoward actions will upset the citizens and inevitably lead to the guards being called. Depending on the severity of your transgression, they may simply search a bit before giving up and returning to their post. But should you offend them severely or repeatedly, they'll become much more aggressive in their pursuits. I've shown you three ways to turn the tide. Remove wanted posters, bribe town criers, or visit a printer to create your own propaganda. This feels wrong. Why not just speak to someone and explain my innocence? You can't be serious. We counter one lie with another. Words on paper instantly taken as truth. And all of it without question. They loose this beast! Or have you forgotten? I merely helped you tame and turn it round. There must be another way. Something more honest. But well, when you find it, do let me know. But until then, we sculpt with the clay we have. My apologies. I do not mean to sound ungrateful. Quite all right. I was much the same at your age. You'll grow out of it. And if I do not? If I refuse? Here we are. Speak with the harbor master, and he'll see you home. Thank you for everything, Sam. I promise one day to repay the favor. Oh, I'm counting on it. Like this. Weird ass NPCs just killing my cutscene, Maya. Exclamation mark. Which I don't know what. Maybe it's a mission? Yeah, that's a mission marker. I'm really far north of Boston. All right. All right, Mr. Achilles, you abandoned me in Boston. Make me have to go through some... producing some fake news. Welcome back. You left me in Boston. The training we've done here is all well and good, but experience is a better teacher by far. What of my father? Into the wind, I'm afraid. We have to find him. And we will, after the house has been repaired. But he's out there, plotting who knows what. And what would you do when you found him, if you found him? You're a boy with a few months of training. He's a man, full-grown, who spent decades honing his skills. 
If you're going to stand a chance against the Templars, you're going to need these. What's he giving me? Is it the hidden blade? Yes. Go on before I change my mind. Sir, please! Help! He's going to die! Who? There's no time! Please, come! Down there! He's just passed under the bridge! Oh, you're the Scottish guys. <coughs> Help me! Please! <coughs> Someone! What this knobend is trying to say is he's forever in your debt, sir. Who are you calling a knobend? You, because you are one. What were you doing on those logs? One of the dangers of lumbering. We've got the camp set up a few rods off of here as we're cutting timber. We're hoping to open a mill in the area. There's a good place not far from the manor on the hill where I'm staying. <laughs> I like you already. We'll have a look. I'll miss the peace and quiet, but we can certainly use the wood. The manor needs a lot of work. That and other things. Meet me at the small shack by the shoreline when you have time. There's something else you need to see. What is it? An asset. Look for missions to recruit new settlers, artisans, farmers. 
Improving your homestead will give you resource trade and unlock new items so you can craft. Alright. Um, gotta go this way. What is this cup? Peg like trinket? Okay. Uh, homestead mission. I can't fast travel. Let's try to see what this homestead mission is. So that's... If I remember, they were all the way up there, so... Let's... Not go in there. Let's try to climb. Giving me Assassin's Suit controls right now. This is not good. How do I lock on? Customize controls. Attack. There is no lock on. Very nice. Of course there's not lock on.
Thank you. Thank you. Are you all right? I think so. Didn't do much to me aside from a good scare. Blaggards. What did they want with you? My purse, which was meager, and they decided to punish me for their trouble. Silly, really. My tools and equipment were worth a king's share to the right man. In any case, I had best get on my way. It's a long walk to the nearest inn. I thank you again for your kindness. Have you no home? Oh, well, I was a proud resident of Boston until recently, but I'm not a supporter of His Majesty, and, well, I was forced out of my wood shop and home by loyalists. There are plenty around here who could use the services of a skilled craftsman if you were looking for somewhere to settle. Is that right? I may look into that. Hello. Um Okay. Looks like I can't interact with them yet. Can I just fast travel? Yes, I can. I found him! People say he's a myth, but I have him! Captain Kidd had a secret to be sure. Just get me a ship and a crew, and we'll find out what it was he held so dear. I met him once, the captain. He was seven feet tall if he was an inch. I tell ya, legs like tree trunks and a smithy's arms. Almost broke my hand shaking a little low. I could kill it then when I met him. No weapon made by man could harm him. Go away! Then go away, boy! Do you not speak the king's English? Oh, I didn't see you there, old man. I'd have set my home in order if I'd known you'd be calling. The boy's name is Connor. He's here to restore the property. Restore? Restore? Pardon my manners. Mm -hmm. 
She's still the fastest in the Atlantic. Sure, she needs some attention. Minor things, mostly, but with a little affection, she'll fly again. What? Who is she? Who is she? Why, the Aquila boy, the ghost of the North Seas. The boat. A, a boat? She's a ship boy, and make no mistake about it. I thought you brought him here to restore order. I reckon he's the greenest thing on the frontier. Connor, meet me back at the manor when you've finished here. You said it requires repairs. You able? She does need work. A ship is a she, boy. And yes, I can refit her, but I'm lacking in the proper supplies. Some, some quality timber would help me get started. I can see to that. How long before it, she, is able to sail again? Just get me the lumber, boy. I'll raise a crew. He is living the life. God damn. All right. Uh, seems like this is the fastest way. I don't want to get wet. Oh, shit. <laughs> I punched the raccoon. you are. I have something to show you. Come, take a look. What is it? A ledger. It lets us manage the homestead's dealings. And these? Uh, that was years ago. Before the slow fever, before the Templars, before everything collapsed. But that's all in the past. Better we focus on what's in front of us. Take up the ledger, and I'll teach you how it all works. All right. Stockpile allows you to purchase items from the homesteaders and display the items you currently own. Press the enter button to end. OK. Um. I don't know what that was about. Time passed quickly after that. My days a blur of study, training, and work. What little free time Achilles allowed me was spent learning about the Templars about Charles Lee and my father. I longed to confront them, to put an end to their schemes, to ensure my people would remain untroubled and free. 
but I knew it was too soon. That to approach them now would see me killed. All my work would be for nothing. Patience, restraint. These proved the most difficult subjects for me. But in time, I mastered them as well. Days became months. Months became years. And as my skills and knowledge grew, so too did I. Nope, I did not want to play a game. Now that an artist, oh, I didn't even read it. I don't know what this is. Get down. Sell to Martha's Vineyards and equip officers must also be hired. Come aboard and feast your eyes, boy. No, 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 not the left foot. Never the left foot. Horrible look. Step with your right foot first. She is... solid? Aye. Weatherly and sleek. 
She'll fetch 12 knots in a stiff gale, near a ship from here to Singapore can outrun her on her best day. What do you say we take her out and show you what she can do first hand? Where would we go? As it happens, she still needs guns and the officers to command them. We'll launch straight away. <laughs> Don't worry, lad. I'll make sure you sprout good sea legs. All in the mainsail! Get up the rigging! Hand over fist! Come on, men! Let's get her out where she needs to be! Oh, God. Come on, lad. No time like the present. Double time, boy. It's time you learnt. Take the helm. Come on, come on, she won't bite. <coughs> You're connected to her now. Listen and half sail. Ah, the killer flies again. Do you feel it, lad? Set a course for Martha's Vineyard. We'll find our guns and officers there. She's a nimble vessel, but the faster she goes, the more cumbersome she grows. And the firmer your hand needs to be. Enjoy this stretch of open water before we come upon those shallows. Call for full sail if you like. Wind looks to be shifting. Stay alert, Connor. Dusty winds can be difficult to manage. Now, take us through these shallows. Careful not to run up on them. The sandbars will slow us down, but the rocks will put a hole through a hole. And if you want to make a quick tack, call for half sail. She's more maneuverable then. All right, got you, but there's a ship right in front of me, so... Guess I'll just follow the ship. Mind those other vessels! Hold your tack to keep your right of way! Ah, uh, the sea music. The Grenadier's Gods music. Cottages. We're close.
Drop anchor. We'll go ashore, buy our guns, and find our officers. Oh, hello, Miss Mandy. You're looking every bit as ravishing as I remember. Hmm. After all these years, you sail all the way to the vineyard to pay me compliments. We are looking for David and Richard Clutterbuck. Hmm. <laughs> nice to see you, too. Robert Faulkner. Where the hell you been? Sorry for leaving like I did, lads, but where I was going, no one could know. You two working much? No. Between contracts at the moment. Well, we're looking for gunnery officers. What would you two say to working with me again? We'd be for getting into a few more scraps. <laughs> <laughs> Good show. The Aquila is a fine vessel. We're fitting all the guns as we speak. Looks like your friend's about to catch a beating. Where is Charles Lee? I don't much care for your tone. Hey, you don't want to be doing that, Biddle. Bobby Faulkner turned to wet nursing. <laughs> it's good you finally realize you're a shite sailor. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Not in here, gentlemen. Better still, not at all. Bobby, take your friends and get out! Let's go, boys. Our guns ought to be ready. Come on. Wasn't Benjamin Church one of the guys we saved earlier in the game? And you just approach him saying, where's Charles Lee? The older man is a Templar. Who was he with? A Templar? The young buck was Nicholas Biddle. Nobody. Sails before the mast. Midshipman for the Crown. Are the guns ready? Aye, but we won't jump in over our heads. We'll find a suitable target and show you how they work. We've fitted her with a modest amount of guns to start, but rest assured there's ample room to add more should you feel the need. There's always going to be a need for more guns. Looks like a British frigate with half seas over. Should do nicely for a spot of target practice. Bring around broadside, and when all guns are on target, call fire. Hold the left trigger. Gun boy! Now, aim all guns at her bow and do as much damage as possible. Try it again, boy. Come about and get all your muzzles on target. Some old powder in there! Good! Now give the swivel guns a turn. More precise. Hit those old powder barrels and light up the sky. We could use those old powder barrels. Um... Ah, never get old. Not bad for a spot, Captain. <laughs> you are a fast learner. Provided something interests me. Ah. Getting a taste for the open sea, are we? No, we're not. We'll make a jack tar out of you yet. Now, we should be getting back. The old man is like to have my hide for keeping you out so long.
Destroying property of the crown, disturbing the king's peace, take it quick! What do we do? Naught else but to fight back! Sink the bastard! Use the swivels on him, Captain! Twattles, another one. Where in the bloody hell did she come from? A BB twaddle. Boy. All right, that wasn't that bad. Now we best be getting back, or the old man will have my guts for garters. Everybody was saying that the ship combat was bad in Assassin's Creed. It wasn't that bad. New painting available at the manor. Now, I kind of wish they shot one more time so that I can duck, but that didn't happen. I got them! All of them! You get what I need, and I'll give them to you. Simple. You got a ship, could find them all to boot. Who is that man? Him? Some old salt always on about letters he's got from Captain Kidd. Nonsense, really, but he doesn't hurt no one, so I'll leave him be. Talk to him if you fancy, but be warned he'll chew your ear off. Anyway, the Aquila's here for you. If you should get a pang for the open sea, we'll be waiting. Now I implore you to head up the hill before the old man comes out of retirement just for me. <laughs> you weeks. And not even a goodbye before you left. Sorry. Well, what are you waiting for? Damn, three weeks? It took three weeks to go that far? I mean, it's, it wasn't even that far. Put them on. Once upon a time, we had a ceremony on such occasions. But I don't think either of us are really the type for that. You've your tools and training, your targets and goals. And now you have your title. Welcome to the Brotherhood, Connor. <coughs> he 
He's looking pimp. Welcome back, Desmond. You'll be happy to hear there's actually good news for once. Yeah? I've managed to locate a power source, and it's relatively close by. Up for a trip to Manhattan? Is it safe to leave? Abstergo's gotta be looking for us. Obviously it's not safe. Can't exactly sit around here hoping to get lucky, though, can we? We need that power source. Besides, I'm sure you can cook up some way to hide our movements. Maybe. The Templars have access to all kinds of satellites and camera systems. We'll need to find a way to mask our digital signature. I can probably camouflage the van, too. But there's not much I can do for us. That's an easy one. Utility companies have assured the public that they're completely prepared for the upcoming solar maximum. Disruptions to service are expected to be minimal. If only they knew. What's this? A remote operated camera. It'll provide us with a feed while you're on mission. This will let us talk to each other. We're almost there, so listen up. The artifact is in an office penthouse in Lower Manhattan. At this time of night, direct infiltration is going to get you noticed. I think we're better off having you drop in from above. What do you mean, above? Testing, one, two, three. Yep, read you just fine. Now why don't you power up the camera? I've got pictures, running diagnostics. Perfect, I've got a nice strong signal. We in my hometown, except this really isn't my hometown. Uh, I hate platformers. Never be able to afford the Manhattan rent. Unless I sue, like, a city or get a nice lawsuit, I'll maybe be able to afford a one bedroom after that. Rather ridiculous how much Manhattan rent prices are. Uh, I guess I wasn't supposed to go that way. I saw one st studio going for almost $8,000. I was like, Oh, that's a hold still. It's a lovely view. <laughs> Seriously, Sean? Fuck you. Can we see where we are? Looks like we're in Midtown. Looks like, but I don't see the Empire State Building. I don't.
Jesus. Look on the bright side. No security to worry about. And on the not so bright side, the slightest misstep means you're effectively at the paste. Shut up, Sean. Shut up, Sean. All right, so. There wouldn't be security up here just because they would be down there. So as long as you avoid security down there, you, you're, you're perfectly fine on a construction site. I mean, who's, who's going to have the firepower or the logisticals to steal one of these pallets? Well, this is a power generator. Steel beam that's just dangling that would be against OSHA. Os OSHA. OSHA, yeah. Almost there, Desmond. Once you reach the top of the lit up crane, you should be high enough to make the jump. Should? It'll be fine, don't worry. Well, you might want to worry a little. I'm pretty sure she was high when she was running the numbers. Sean! A joke. It was a joke. Or was it? That's a good question. Was she? Oh, God. If you are ever so slightly a fairy of heights, this is not a good game for you. Easy done. Let's swap over here. Climb up. Climb up. Oh man. Where am I supposed to go? I'm guessing the helipad. There's a guy right there. Or is that a light? That's a light. Why exactly do I have my messenger bag? That wasn't so bad. So, you must be Desmond. Not exactly what I expected, but I guess your kind doesn't have many options these days. Who are you? Ask your father. Now give me that. I don't think so. Look. I'm not supposed to kill you. But the boss man didn't say anything about fucking you up. So you got to the count- oh! Got punched in the face. So who the hell is Daniel Cross? Believe it or not, he used to be an assassin. The assassin, the way I've heard it told, but it turned out he was a sleeper agent for Abstergo, programmed to infiltrate and destroy the organization. How did he know you were there? We could be compromised. They must have caught me snooping inside their network and sent Cross to see what we were after. If 
they were aware of our current location, we'd know. Though, I will say this. It doesn't bode very well for future expeditions. I've set up some cameras topside. If anyone shows up, we'll see it. I'd suggest you go see about finding a socket for that power source. Or we can return to Connor if you prefer. All the artifacts in the world won't mean a thing without the key. I know everyone thinks I'm being silly, but I can't shake the feeling we're being watched. We are being watched. By Juno. Or some version of her. Do you think it's a recording? Or is she a ghost? Or something else? Is she talking to us the way Minerva talked to Ezio? No clue. I mean, who knows what else they were working on down here. There's still so many rooms we don't have access to. But do you think she's like literally down here, waiting somewhere, still alive? Still alive? That's mental. That I mean she'd be at least 75, 80,000 years old? So powerful, yeah, but not that powerful. They came down here looking for a way to survive. Maybe they found one. Is it weird seeing Cross? What do you mean? It's different for you. You don't know about what happened, I guess. For a long time, he was important to us. He was a different person. Sean said he was a sleeper agent, like Lucy. It was different. She made a choice, but Cross, if you read the files, Abstergo just, they, they did terrible things to him. Rebecca? You're lucky. We all are. We have people who care about us, who look out for us. He was all alone, and the people he thought he could trust, they used him. Did you know him? No, but I knew Hannah. Who's that? She tried to help him. She trusted him. But there was a raid about a year ago. She stayed behind so the others could escape. Tried to reason with him, to see if she could fix things. Well, what happened? What do you think happened? He killed her. That's what he does. That's all he knows how to do. Sometimes it seems like that's all any of us know how to do. Rebecca. I just want to be alone right now. Let's go talk to Dad. Son, I, uh, I owe you an apology. I, I shouldn't have lashed out like that. You have to understand, I've never been very good at this. Never mind that we live rather extraordinary lives. Yeah, I kind of liked my ordinary one. You can't escape who you are, Desmond. So I've noticed. Look, it's silly for us to go back and forth like this. I admit, I did a shitty job raising you. I apologize, I'm sorry. But it's important you understand it didn't come from a bad place. You're my son. I love you. I guess I was so busy trying to make sure nothing bad happened, I didn't consider the consequences. Truce. I can't believe it's taken me so long to ask, but... How's Mom? She's not... No, 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 no. Your mother is fine. We decided it was safer if we split up for this job. Always assuming the worst. <laughs> for good reason. Can I at least say hi to her? I'm sorry, it's too risky. Maybe when we're done. Right. When we're done. Have... have we ever tried to make peace with the Templars? Throughout our history, there have been moments. Several, in fact. But... it's impossible. There are existential differences, insurmountable. If there were to be unity, it wouldn't be a truce so much. 
as a submission. But knowing what's about to happen, wouldn't it make sense to try and talk to Vidic? Come to an arrangement, even if it's only temporary? We'd all be so busy watching our backs, nothing would get accomplished. <laughs> Imagine that. We're more productive at war. Well, have we ever tried sending in someone? Doing to them what they did to us with Lucy? Or Cross? We have, and it's never worked. We've sent people who were either too weak and found themselves turned, or too strong and were unable to carry out the charade. I just feel like we all want the same thing. We use the same words, but that's all they are, words. In the end, it all comes down to freedom. We seek it, they detest it. And so there's never an end to the fight. Not until one side is completely gone. Is that even possible? Probably not. Our two groups have existed in one form or another since, well, since forever. But things can be better than they are. And that's something. Did you look for me, Dad? When I was gone? Every day. Come on. I mean it. Every night I'd look, searching for your name or variations of it, hoping you'd slip up. Abstergo only found you first because they had better access. A few more days and it would have been me. Well, I'm here now. And I'm glad. Do you think Lucy regretted what she was doing? I used to think I knew her well, but clearly that wasn't the case. So I really can't give you an honest answer. She seemed so sincere, though. Like she really wanted to make a difference. Yes, well, when I first met him, I thought the same thing about Cross. It just keeps happening over and over again. What does? Everything. Don't get weird on me, Desmond. <laughs> no, it, it's fine. I'm fine. Don't worry. All right, then. You should think about getting back in the Animus. We've got to find that key. We should probably get back to Connor. Let's talk to Mr. Not so much of an asshole. Where are you going? Ah, Desmond, there you are. Can I ask a favor? Maybe. When this is all over, I'd like to try turning the dial back on the Animus. Like, all the way back. To the time of the first civilization. You think it would work? There was no real loss of fidelity when you visited Altair. Then again, that was about a thousand years ago, and I'm looking at going back at least 70,000 more. Sure, I'd be up for it. It'd be interesting to see what things were like back then. Excellent. I think it would prove most enlightening. So this is how it started. What are you up to? Just brushing up on my American history. Well, I say history. They certainly teach you strange things in the States. Like what? Well, for all the talk of this being a revolutionary war, it was a civil one. Well, not that kind of civil. I mean, there was no America versus Britain. It was Brit on Brit action. And you can clearly see how the whole thing got started. One war gave birth to the other. You mean the Seven Years' War? Exactly. Seems the Crown overspent in its attempt to keep the French out, wound up with a great deal of debt. Believing that the colonists should help to shoulder the burden, new taxes were created. It was a reasonable request, even if Parliament was rather, well, undiplomatic about it. Well, it's not really fair to tax people for a war they didn't want any part of. What? Didn't want any part of? Did you not notice George Washington with Edward Braddock? He was right there in the middle of it. That yeah, was Here him. you have the Crown spending who knows how much money to secure a place for the colonists to thrive, and then, when they ask for a little bit of help... Right, look, think of it this way. King George and the colonists they all go out to dinner, right? And when the bill comes, George asks for them to kick in and pay their share. Fair enough. But keep in mind, he's been taking them out to dinner gratis for decades now. But the colonists, oh no, they insist they only had a glass of water and a side salad. Never mind the table's full of half-eaten food and empty bottles of wine. Then when the king points this out, what do the colonists do? Oh, they flip the table over and they storm out the restaurant. Probably intending to turn later and burn it down. You left out the part where the king pointed a gun at the colonists and asked them to cover dinner for everyone in the restaurant. Right, right, yeah, interesting take. If he pulled out a gun, and I'm not sure he did, it would only have been after the 
hundredth failed attempt at getting them to pay their fair share. But how do you define someone's fair share? Oh, well, with a war, apparently. You know what, Sean? I thought you were less of an asshole. Now you are fully an asshole. I wonder how many other places like this exist. There are dozens of them, all over the world. And somehow no one's ever found one before us. I don't think that's true. Oh? When I was at Abstergo, Vidic talked about silencing discoveries made by non-Templars. And I'm sure Abstergo has dug up plenty. The things they must know. Regretting throwing in with us? <laughs> no. Just looking forward to when we can finally trounce those bastards so I can dive into their archives. Oh, I think I found a lead on another power source. Later, Desmond. I'm in the middle of something very important right now. Just a, a rule. Just follow that as a rule.